Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. In a recent Chromium blog post, Google is now saying while you are using Google Chrome in Windows, you should see faster startup times, quicker performance, and at the end of the day, the browser should feel and seem a whole lot faster when using it in Windows. Now, just to give you a little bit of background here at first, the Microsoft Edge web browser, which is also a Chromium-based web browser, has a feature called Sleeping Tabs. And how this works is if you have any background tabs open that you aren't using um, in a certain time period, those background tabs will go to sleep to save system resources. Now, Google say that over the last couple of years, they've also been lowering the priority of those background tabs in the Chrome browser by throttling JavaScript in those tabs, and which means that those background tabs then won't render web content, which at the end of the day will save system resources which leaves more memory, CPU, and GPU for your foreground tabs um, that you're actually using and seeing on your desktop. Now, through a couple of experiments, um, Google found that nearly 20% of Chrome windows were completely covered by other windows um, when used in the Windows operating system. Now, as an example, as many of you know, a lot of Chrome users browse with more than one window open in the browser. And when running Chrome with these other uh, browser windows open, um, they could be covered by other app windows in the Windows operating system, which means that if you had any background tabs running in these, um, uh, these um, other open uh, windows in the browser, which could be minimized or covered by other windows uh, in the Windows operating system, those background tabs um, were not being throttled and we're not, were not giving the desired performance and boost to the browser that Google wanted due to them being covered by other windows or minimized to the taskbar. And basically what um, uh, Google calls this is they are being occluded. So around three years or so ago, Google say they started working on a project to track this occlusion state of each Chrome window in real time and then try to lower the priority of tabs those background tabs in those occluded windows, or as an example, those windows uh, in the Chrome browser that were covered by other windows or minimized to the taskbar or even moved to another screen. And they called this project Native Window Occlusion. And the effect and the results they were trying to achieve, they say that if occluded windows were treated like background tabs, Chrome's performance would be a whole lot better in the Windows operating system. Now, due to a lot of compatibility issues over those last three years, due to this, uh, the, uh, this announcement in this Chromium blog, which I will leave um, a link to down below if you're interested, as there's a whole lot more information here regarding this topic, if this is something that would interest you. Due to some compatibility issues in those tests over the last couple of years, this feature actually started rolling out 100% to all Chrome users in Windows only in October of last year, 2020. And that was in version 86 of Google Chrome. We are now in version 96 of Google Chrome. And where they say uh, our metrics show significant performance benefits with the feature turned on. And that feature, as we say, is that um, native window occlusion. And yeah, the results here, um, are 8.5% to 25.8% faster startup, 3.1% reduction in GPU memory usage, that's your graphics processing unit, 20.4% fewer renderer frames drawn overall, 4.5% fewer clients experiencing renderer crashes, 3% improvement in first input delay, and 6.7% improvement in first content full paint and largest content full paint. And they say, uh, that when Chrome restores two or more full screen windows when starting up, one of the windows is likely to be occluded as mentioned, which means Chrome will now skip much of the work for that window, thus saving resources for the more important foreground window as mentioned. So as according to this blog post and as mentioned, Google says now you should be finding the Chrome browser a lot quicker and faster uh, when using Chrome in Windows the Windows operating system. So I hope you found this video useful. Once again, thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.